This maths video is going to talk about the mean, mode and the median and I will also quickly discuss what is meant with the range. Yeah, and important now to realize is, is that the mean, mode and median all say something about the average of a set of data. Yeah, and sometimes it's better to use the mean to say something about the average, sometimes the median and sometimes the mode. Yeah, and I will talk about that in the next video when you use which one best. But just now to explain what they are, let's say I have a set of data uh, let's say 5, 8, uh, 2, 6, 7 and 8. Yeah? This could be your math scores or perhaps uh, the amount of goals scored in each football game. doesn't really matter now. Yeah? Just for our understanding uh, of what the mean, mode and median are. Now the mean, to say something about the average, yeah, is I would plus them all, the sum of the values. Yeah? So the sum of all the values divided by the amount of values and perhaps this is the most yeah, classic way to calculate the average yeah, perhaps you have been using this already in the past yeah, if you want to know the average so I would say well I do 5 plus 8 plus 2 plus 6 plus 7 plus 8 yeah? so I plus them all the sum of the values divided by 3, 4, 5, 6 values so divided by 6 let me see, that's 10, 15, 20, 1, 20, 36 divided by 6. So the mean is 6 of this set of data. Yeah? The mean, the average is 6. Now, the mode. Okay. Now, the mode is that piece of information that occurs most frequently. Yeah, so the mode is that piece of information that occurs most frequently. And in this particular case, that is the, sorry, the eight. The eight occurs twice, while the rest only occurs once. So the eight is the mode. It's as simple as that, okay? And the last one is the median. And the median is that piece of information exactly in the middle. Yeah, but in order to calculate the median, first I have to order my information then in ascending order, which means I start with the lowest and I go up two and then a five and then a six and then a seven and then I have an eight and an eight. And I always check if I didn't forget one because that's mistakes we make. One, two, three, four, five, six pieces of information. One, two, three, four, five, six pieces of information. All right, so what is that piece of, of information in the middle? I start cutting myself the way inwards and I have yeah two numbers now a six and a seven sometimes you have one number then the median is that particular number but because I have two numbers now I say so the median is six plus seven divided by two uh, I, I basically take the mean of those two numbers uh, which is 13 divided by two which is six and a half so the median would be six and a half all right so mean mode median in order to distinguish between the three, you could say, well, your teachers, of course, are very mean. Yeah, we are very horrible, mean uh, human beings. And that's how we calculate your uh, test scores. Yeah? What is going to the score on your report? We add up all the values of your test and we divide it by the amount of tests we gave you. Yeah? We are very mean. And the mode or the mode, yeah, in, in, in Holland, that is like the most popular clothes you would wear. Yeah? So what is the most popular piece of information? In this case, the eight. And the median, like a mediator, yeah, tries to, tries to uh, yeah, sit in the middle uh, and solve a conflict. Yeah? So a mediator sits in the middle as that piece of information. Okay, now I, will, uh, I wanna say two more things. First of all, what is the range? Now the range is the difference between the largest piece of information and the smallest piece of information. Yeah. So all the pieces of information, the range lies uh, between them. So what is the largest piece of information? That is an eight, and the smallest is the two. So the range is going to be six. Yeah. The range, the largest piece of information, take away uh, the smallest piece of information. Okay. Um, I want to say two more things. For instance, let's say that 8 wouldn't be there. What would be my mode now? Well, in that case, I would have no mode. Yeah? Because all pieces of information occur only once. Yeah? But I could have, for instance, another 7. And what would be my mode now? 
Well, now would, my mode would be eight and seven. I would have two modes. Yeah, that's perfectly fine. That's perfectly normal um, to have two or three modes, yeah, or no mode. Uh, don't say zero, no, you say no mode, okay? I'm gonna take that one away again because that was just a late addition to the question. Uh, the mean, your teachers are mean, sum of all the values divided by the amount of values, the mode, what is the most popular piece of information, you can have no mode or more than one mode, and the median, a mediator sits in the middle, but make sure first to order your information in ascending order, yeah? Do not just cut yourself inwards here, it's gonna be wrong, a very commonly made mistake, mistake, no, please order it, and then you find the middle value. All right, next video.